Hi, it's me again with Corel Draw Tips and Tricks, and somebody sent me a question via email. They wanted to draw a rectangle, and they wanted scalloped corners on two sides and chamfered corners on the other. But whenever you go and pick your rectangle, and then you change it to chamfered, it changes your original, so you can't just chamfer those. So let's back up and put them to round corners. And I've got... And if you're not aware, you can unlock this lock right here and change just one corner. So let's just make it two inches. And then we'll go to this corner and make it two inches. But he wants these two corners chamfered. I don't 100% know why, but this rectangle is 18 inches or a little bit more. So I'm going to change my nudge factor to 20. And I'm going to control D and make a duplicate. I'm going to move it over 20 inches. Then I'm going to take this and chamfer it. And then I'm going to take it and mirror it vertically. Then I'm going to take my original and move it back over that 18 inches. Get my Smart Fill color tool and fill it in. And now you have chamfered and scalloped corners in the same I don't know what he's making, if he's putting this in a corner or what he wants a rounded edge. And these aren't the dimensions. He's, uh, he just wanted chamfered on two corners up top and, and scalloped on the bottom two. That's one way to do it. Anyway, hope that helped a little bit. Thank you for watching.